Sanchez gonna do that for Ness from Reigns. Green time. <laughs> so we're looking at 89 rated icon Hugo Sanchez. Five foot nine, high medium work rates, three star skill, four star weak foot, left footed, can play striker or centre forward. Now he's got 91 shot power, 91 finishing, 82 composure, with 90 GT and 87 balance. So right there suggests he's gonna be a very, very good striker. Fantastic acceleration and sprint speed as well. Very good header and accuracy. Looks like a general good card overall, good short pass. And then we've got play styles. We've got ourselves a finesse shot, dead ball, and power header. First touch, flare, acrobatic plus, which means he can volley things better than most players, and aerial. I don't really use volleys very often, so whether we'll see that today or not, I'm not entirely sure. Now, in terms of chem styles, we could have gone for a hunter, but in my opinion, I think it's a little bit wasted. So we went for a hawk. I know with a Hunter, of course, he's going to maximize his finishing to 99, obviously give him 97 pace overall. But with a Hawk, we're going to have 93 pace, but we're going to have 99 shot power. And I personally think shot power is more important than finishing. Luckily for me, he's on mostly explosive. I love players that are on mostly explosive. But the high work rates, he should be very good sitting on last man. Average body type's a little bit concerning, but I will add, because he's got high agility and balance of 1987, I don't think it'll be an issue. We are going to be playing in foot champs today. It is weekend league now, so let's see how we get on with him. His main job is going to be up front in our 4-2-3-1 system. And as we jump into a game, we can have a look at our opponent's team. Now, what I'm expecting him to do is basically get goals, of course. But on top of that, see what his game is like when he dribbles on the ball. Is he as clinical as the card suggests? How good he is in certain situations with link-up play and etc. So we are going to switch to our defensive one, which is our 4-2-3-1. It's actually an attacking formation. Get him on the ball early and then try and drive him through. So that's going to be where he's sitting anyway on last man driving through. He's want to stretch their defense out a little bit. Now we can drive in. Play that pass. Oh, look at that for a turn. Oh, I dropped with there. But you can see that's how quick he's going to be. He's going to be up front on his own, as mentioned. Good tackle. So share what I could do with the turn there. So, so far, I'm noticing very, very quick on the exit of the uh, RBLB left stick or right stick flick. And that's something I like a lot with a player who can do that. And so on. Sanchez holding off against Rudiger. Nowhere to go. Reset the attack. Back to Son. Sanchez, lovely turn into the snapshot and a good save from the goalkeeper. So already causing trouble. We'll have a look at his set pieces. So he's very good at penalty. Actually, he's very good at everything. So what we're going to do here is we're going to take it with him, call someone over, and then try to play it back to him in the box. We're going to go this way. And they got the space. Back to Sanchez. Using that skill, shot across goal and a great finish there. Even though he's got three-star skill moves, you do a hill-to-hill -hill in that situation, he can hold players off. Now, instantly, he's becoming very clinical. I've already noticed. Good left foot finish. Good tackle from our opponent there. Sanchez just running it. Now he's running through. Trying to get past Van Dijk. Going for that long-range shot. Good save from the keeper. Sanchez on the ball. Better hill-to-hill. Pass the tackle. Oh, I tried to run around the keeper. <laughs> right, here we go. Stop that attack. Sanchez running the last man. Oh, I've left it too late. That is a shame. He's offside. That's poor from me. Should be getting and clean through there. Good movement off the ball, though. That's what I want my last striker or my only striker to do in that role when he's up front. Breaking between the lines. Well, we're actually 2-1 down now. We need to step up. Oh, Sanchez has broke through. Easy finish, and we're back in the game now. Two all, great finish from him there. Good tackle, good left stick. Pass one, pass two. Sanchez, hat-trick, top corner. And there's that agility and balance, as we mentioned. Absolutely smashing it through. Great, great performance from him so far. 3-2, we've got one hell of a game on our hands here. Interception. Into Sanchez, using that pace. Oh, what a tackle from Rudiger there. Sanchez again, running on the last man. Not the best pass from Dembele, but we do get the ball. Do find Dembele. We stretch the defence now. Nearly. Right, can't attack. Into Son. Rise the tackle. Find Sanchez. Right foot across. And a lovely finish over the keeper. And he's very clinical. Especially if you're green timing your shots on top with the power. You can see there... On his weak foot, a cross goal from distance. Now we've got a two-goal lead, and it's all down to Sanchez. He's got four goals for us up front. He is very, very good. Sanchez. Oh, and the skill. One-on-one. -on -one. Keeper movement, and I've kicked it wide. That's a shame. Off the skill. Oh, bad kick from the goalkeeper. 
Sanchez trying to cause problems. Not quite. And that is half time. So four goals for Sanchez. He should have had a few more. Very unlucky off the roulette spin that we did to get through one and one with the keeper. Another day I would have buried that. What I'm noticing with the card is not only is he very strong, but he's very, very fast on the left stick dribble, which makes him an absolute pain to play against because all he's doing is basically shielding off against Van Dyke. When Rudiger comes over and he then explodes into the most explosive and then drills past him and his left foot is absolutely terrifying for a goalkeeper. He's so clinical. But let's jump into the second half and see how we get on in this half. Sanchez going to do that. Finesse from Reigns. Green time. <laughs> Don't forget, he's only got the uh, the power shot, the power header, and that's it. He doesn't have finesse shot, I believe, or have I forgotten? But that is an absolute mad finish. <laughs> got him through here. Not the best pass. Good strength again, as I mentioned, away from Rudiger. Now we've got the space in behind. Nearly found Son there. Sanchez, little one, two. Back to him. Good touch in. Pass Van Dyke. Oh, he took a heavy touch. I tried to go for a shot there in the end. Very unlucky. Ah, oh, it's too easy. Sanchez does keep the ball a little bit there. Gets hacked down, but... Ah, oh, too easy again. That's a good tackle. Lovely pass into Sanchez. Takes a touch. Quick shot. And again, Van Dyke blocking it. We could do with one more goal here. Right, counter-attack. Straight away into Son. Sanchez running, we got him through. Oh, he's got a lot of work to do. Ball roll away, and Rudiger, good tackle there. Sanchez in between again. Again, Van Dyke's come over. Right, let's go, counter attack. We've got Sanchez on last man. Still got a lot to do. He's very tired now. Bit of skill pass one, skill pass two. Oh, last ditch tackle keeps the ball though. Gets a keeper down, that's got to be a penalty. What just happened? How have we not had a penalty there? It's going to be the end of the game anyway. What a dramatic end to the game. We won 5-4. Very tough game. Sanchez getting all the goals for us, I believe. And basically, he was unbelievable today. 9.3. Should have had a pen right at the end as well. He had 17 dribbles, 29 complete. Seven shots on target, five goals. If that doesn't tell you how clinical he is, I don't know what is. Outside the box, right foot across goal, left foot across goal, left foot near post. Very, very good. Passing, 100% pass accuracy as well. Fantastic card. Now, let's go jump back over to Footbin. So, he's coming in about 435k, which I think is crazy cheap for a card of this caliber. Now, I will add, he's probably the cheap because he doesn't have finesse shot. Even though we scored a green time finesse outside the box, he can do it. Because he doesn't have it, I think it puts people off. Again, I'd probably stick to a Hawk. The shot power of 99 came in massive for us and we shot across goal with his right foot from distance. I generally think if he had a Hunter on, most likely doesn't score that, but we'll never know, of course. But overall, he's a really good card. He can play out front on his own. We saw that today. Play out front in a two. He can play outside in the left or the right as wingers. And overall, really, really good card. Now, if he's probably going to get another special card along the road, that wouldn't surprise me in terms of like a team of the year icon or something like that. Who knows what EA are going to do. But I think generally right now, this card is very, very top tier. I think if you need someone who's going to be very clinical and very, very quick and good on the left stick dribble, then he's going to be right up there on your list to go get him. If you don't like left stick dribbling and you prefer the players who pass a little bit more and do link up play, he's good at it, but I would recommend other players instead. But that being said, if you have any questions about this card or any other card, comment down below. If you're new to the channel, smash that like button, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.